Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for September 19th of 2022. Well, it is titled Star Trails and Lightning over the Pyrenees. So what do we see here? Well, we see the Pyrenees Mountains in the foreground. And you can see those and then city lights just below those. And just up above them, we can see a great lightning storm going on there. So lots of clouds and lots of bolts of lightning. However, the storm is off in the distance because you can certainly see the uh, star trail. You can see the stars up above. And of course, those are the objects that are furthest away from us, whereas everything else here is on our own Earth. Those stars are, of course, up in the sky, being hundreds or even thousands of light years away. Now, this is actually a long exposure that took six minutes to be able to see uh, everything here. And you can see the car lights around the road are just streaks of light highlighting the path of the road uh, down in the foreground. It allows us to see a number of lightning strikes that occurred over that six minute time frame. So all that lightning, of course, did not go off at once, but over a period of time, in this case, six minutes. When we take a long exposure like that and we have stars in the image, the stars will appear to move. And that is because we are focused on here on Earth, but Earth is rotating. Now we don't notice our Earth rotating very easily, but we can see that motion reflected in the stars up above. And by taking an exposure here on Earth and not tracking the camera to follow Earth's rotation, we see that the stars seem to follow paths in the sky that are little arcs. So you can get a little bit of an idea of the curvature, even at this shorter exposure, and how the pole, which would be the central point here, if you imagine these as circles stretched around the sky, would be up off above the image. And that would be the location of Polaris, the star nearest to the North Celestial Pole. So if you took a longer image, the trails would continue, we would see even longer trails. And could you take a complete trail for a whole day, you would see them making circles around the North Pole. However, of course, that is difficult. Because in most areas, the sun would be out making it very hard to get images during the daylight hours. So you can see in most areas, just in parts of the star trails, as we see here in this six minute exposure showing the stars, the lightning and thunderstorms and the city down below. So that was our picture of the day for September 19th of 2022. It was titled Star Trails and Lightning over the Pyrenees. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be star shells. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone. And I will see you in class.